Hi students. So today, topic 7, trigonometric functions, subtopic 7.3, solutions of trigonometric equations. So, the course learning outcome for today is Solve the equations in quadratic form. The value for theta must be given in a specific range, such as 0 degree until 2 pi or 0 degree until 360 degree. Let's see trigonometric quadratic equations. Firstly, A sine power of 2 theta plus b sine theta plus k equal to 0. Secondly, a cos power of 2 theta plus b cos theta plus k equal to 0. And lastly, a tangent power of 2 theta plus b tangent theta plus k equal to 0. The trigonometric identities are very important in solving the above trigonometric quadratic equations. Example number 1. 3 cos power of 2x minus 2 sin x minus 3 equal to 0. The range is 0 degree less than or equal to x and 2 pi is more than or equal to x. The solution are cos power of 2x. By using the formula, we can write as y minus sine power of 2x we have a new equation which is 3 minus 3 sine power of 2x minus 2 sine x minus 3 equal to 0. Simplify the equation and we get sine x in bracket 3 sine x plus 2 equal to 0. Then we get sine x equal to 0 or sine x equal to negative 2 over 3. For sine x equal to 0, firstly find the basic angle. We get 0. Secondly, find the range. Thirdly, x lies in first and second quadrants. The diagram was shown. The angle was at the first and second quadrants. So x equal to 0, pi and 2 pi. For sine x equal to negative 2 over 3, firstly find the basic angle and we get 0 0.7297 radian. Secondly, find the range. Thirdly, x lies in third and fourth quadrants. From the diagram, we can know that the angle is at the third and fourth quadrants. So we get x equal to 3.8713 radian and 5.5535 radian. So, lastly, we list all of the answer. x equal to 0 by 3.8713 radian, 5.5535 radian and 2 pi.